Yo, what's going on guys, it's Houston Sports Talk back in the video today, and today we're going to be talking about the Houston Astros game as the Astros match up against the Toronto Blue Jays for the third game of a four-game series after absolutely just getting demolished yesterday, and honestly, was not surprised. I mean, I'm, I hate to be, I really do hate to be, you know, you know, what would be the word, I hate to be negative towards the Astros but we are terrible after scoring 10 runs in a game we were fantastic in the first game of this series scored 11 runs and hitting well we hit I think four or five home runs Corey Jolks hit a grand slam Jake hit a two-run shot Kyle hit a solo um who Jordan hit a home run I think that was it for the Astros in that with homers in that game absolutely killed it won 11 to 4 worked absolutely dominant but the thing is going back to last year the Astros are for some reason are not able to score more than one run whenever scoring 10 plus runs in the previous game and it is a curse that has continued to go on for the Houston Astros and I'm excited to see what the Astros show us today after absolutely um doing the bats were dry I mean Hit a, fir- hit a hit a home run in the on the second pitch of the game by Mauricio Mauricio Dubon, uh, crushed one in the second in the in, this, uh, in the second pitch of the game. But after that, the Astros didn't score a run in the game. I think the Astros only finished with about four or five hits in yesterday's game. Bats were dry and looked horrible, to be honest. But I am really excited for today's game for the Houston Astros. I'm only going to be watching about an hour of it because the NBA Finals are on today. But I'm going to be trying to watch some of these at bats because. Top some of the top news is for the Ashes today. Number one, Greg Kissner, uh, who was just called up third baseman. Well, he's mainly a shortstop, but can play third base and second base, and he's playing third base tonight. Um, he's wearing number sixteen too, so that's a Lesmus Diaz old number. It's gonna be weird. I mean, I'm gonna be honest. It's gonna be weird. Someone. It's gonna be weird seeing someone. In the an Astros uniform, wearing that number sixteen number after Diaz wore that for from for all the way f- from two thousand nineteen to, to twenty twenty two. But um, I'm really excited about Greg Hissner. I know he's not going to play that much, but um, he's getting a start today. I think this is one of many starts for Greg Kissinger with the Astros in this in this next couple stretch of games because the Astros do not have a lot of days off. Uh, the Astros are giving Jeremy Pena and Alex Bregman the day off, and I don't know if I've ever been this excited about. Jeremy Pena and Alex Bregman not playing in a game because not only do we get Greg Kissner not making his MLB debut, and I'm not saying he's going to be a you know a big player for us. I mean I always like seeing how you know and I like seeing you know to watch potential decent players, and I think Greg Kissner has that chance. He's a he's a deep threat. He's a really good really good infielder as well, and I'm really excited to see what he brings on on the field and at the plate. But not only that. Jose Altuve is finally returning. I I didn't think this was possible because I I read I was looking at last night I was looking at the Astros injury report when I looked at Jose Altuve it said that they didn't really expect him to be uh, back after June seventh. Maybe they thought he could possibly be back for Thursday's game, but Altuve is back in the game and we're sp- we're seeing him at the two spot today, which is a little surprising. Um, I get Dubon's been amazing at that leadoff spot, but. When was the last time we've seen Altuve not at the leadoff spot for the Astros? I think ever since George Springer's left, I think ever since George Springer has left, whenever Altuve's been in the lineup, he's been at that leadoff spot for the Astros. I might be wrong, but if I'm not mistaken, this is the first game Jose Altuve is playing since George Springer left the Astros not at the leadoff spot. I could be wrong, but... It feels like to me Altuve's been at that leadoff spot every game he's played since George Springer left. And Dubon's done so well, and Altuve's coming back. They're giving Pena and Bregman the day off. That means Dubon's playing, and thus he's giving Dubon at the leadoff spot, and Altuve's going to be at the two spot today in this game. So let's go over the full lineup for the Astros today. Mauricio Dubon is at shortstop for the Astros, and with Pena getting the day, the day off, and he's at the one spot. He's at the leadoff spot for the Astros. Then Jose Altuve is at second baseman, of course, and at the two spot for the Astros. Jordan Alvarez will be the DH in this game at the three spot, and then Kyle Tucker will be at four as the cleanup hitter and at right field. Then five will be Jose Abreu at first base, and our favorite, all of our favorite catcher. 
everybody's favorite catcher, Yanner Yanner Diaz um, at Yanner Diaz at catcher in this game for the Astros. Um, so Yanner's at six and at catcher for the Astros. And then Corey Jolks is at seven and at left field. And then Chas McCormick is at eight and and at center at at center field. And then nine is the kid making his major league debut, Greg Kissner at third base. And then making his second career start as a pitcher, Ronald Blanco is in for the Houston Astros on the mound tonight after a decent first start in the MLB. So, you guys are your thoughts? I'm excited about this lineup. I hope the Astros score more than one run tonight. Who knows? But I, I think it should be a decent game for the Astros today. I'm excited to see Greg Kissner's first game. Excited to see Yanner at that sixth spot today in the Astros. I'm excited to see Jose Altuve back in the lineup for the Strohs. And uh, glad to see Dubon again as he hit a home run yesterday. You guys are your thoughts on the game. And that's it for the video. If you guys enjoyed, peace out. Go Astros.